Okay, next example. Two cars, one going to do east at the rate of 90 kilometers per hour, and the other going due south at the rate of 60 kilometers per hour, are traveling toward the intersection of the two roads. At what rate are the two cars approaching each other at the instant when the first car is 0.2 kilometers and the second car is 0.15 kilometers from the intersection? So, from our illustration here, car A, car A that is going to south, due south, so that is 90 degrees. Then the other one that is second car, that is car B that is going to due east, that is zero degrees, due east. So, and then the two here, they are traveling toward the intersection. So, they are traveling toward the intersection. So, therefore, the rate of change of Y here, because that is going downward, the rate of change of Y here is negative. The rate of change of X, because that is decreasing. The value of X here is decreasing. If they will meet at the inter intersection here, it is, uh, how fast are they going to the intersection so you will have here the rate the rate of change of y is negative so do with the rate of change of x because the value of x and y for this problem they are decreasing so we have here given car b that is the rate of change of x with respect to time that is negative 90 kilometers per hour that is negative since x here is decreasing dy dt the rate of change of y with respect to time that is negative 60 kilometers per hour because the value of y is decreasing okay we will have our solution here so if you are going to if you are going to look at the figure so what formula in your mind what formula that you can formulate out of that figure? That is a right triangle, diba? So if that is right triangle, so we will be using what? Pythagorean theorem. Okay, let's try to solve. So the unknown here, we are going to find the rate of change of Z. Because we designate as we designate Z as the distance between the two cars. So, so the two cars are approaching towards the intersection, towards here, and the other car. So they are approaching towards this intersection. So, Z here, what do you think is the value of Z? Is C increasing or decreasing? So, what do you think? If X and Y, they are approaching towards the intersection, what do you think is the value of Z? Is it increasing or decreasing? So, of course, when they are approaching each other, so, of course, the value of C is okay. You can you can see based on the dotted figure. So the value of C is decreasing. So if that is decreasing, how how can you express decreasing? So we will be expecting that the value of the rate of change of Z with respect to time is negative. Why negative? Because it is decreasing. And to express decreasing, that is negative. Okay, solution here. We are going to find the rate of change of Z with respect to time. When X is equal to 0.2 kilometers, Y is equal to 0.15 kilometers. So, solution. 
So by Pythagorean theorem, we have z squared is equal to x squared plus y squared. So the x here is changing, the y is changing, z is changing. So we are going to find the derivative of z, derivative of x, derivative of y. So that is my implicit differentiation. So therefore you will have z square is equal to x square plus y square derivative with respect to time. So you will have 2z dz over dt. The, so derivative of z square that is 2z derivative of z without exponent. That's the reason we have dc over dt. Here, derivative of x squared, that is 2x. Derivative of x without exponent, okay. Plus 2y. Derivative of y without exponent. So, if you are going to look at here, this is divisible by 2. It's 2, 2. So, you can express that as z dz over dt then you will have x dx over dt plus y dy over dt so that's it so therefore we are going to solve for dz dt so we're solving for dz dt that is equal to x dx dt plus y dy dt divided by z. So we are going to substitute, substitute the values, x is equal to 0.2 and y is equal to 0.15 so substitute the values dz dt that is equal to x so 0 0.2 times okay you will have dx dt so it's given that dx dt that is equal to negative 90 plus 0.15 dy dt is negative 60 divided by okay, the value of z. What is the value of z? So the value of z here, okay, we will have, what is the value of z? z is equal to the square root of, okay x square x it is point two square plus y point fifteen square z is equal to what is the value of z for that case okay by using our calculator z is equal to z is equal to point 25 so 0 0.25 dz dt that is equal to by using your calculator you will have negative negative 108 unit here that is kilometer per hour or you just state that dz dt is equal to 108 kilometers per hour decreasing. So if you will not use negative, you write there decreasing so that we will know. So that is now your final answer. 
so cases like this one if you will have two you will have two you will have two that is common so you can reduce that one into this is divisible by two divisible by two divisible by two so you can reduce that one that is still the same so that is your answer thank you